Hi everyone! So we're gonna do our energy healing for today. My name is Lindsay. I'm an intuitive energy healer. We will choose a card and do healing. <laughs> so comment below that you're open to this healing and put in your favorite flower emojis. I want to see lots of flowers. <laughs> okay, and we'll call upon God universe angels all the highest beings of infinite love and light to help with this session and allow all this healing to go to you to your twin flame or your beloved soul family your ancestors this is something better for the highest and the greatest good of all wow their cards are going crazy <laughs> crazy okay this is a card Ooh, pretty it says sacred union Beloved within and inner and outer relationships. Okay, let's tune in. And if you haven't watched uh, yesterday's video on the new moon, I recommend it because that one was so fun. We did like a celebration ceremony, ceremony for the um, uh, eclipse season that we all went through and yeah just grounding it all in grounding in all that work and really honoring all that we've gone through in this life to be here today and it's so beautiful to celebrate and take time for yourself to celebrate all because that anchors it in so yeah definitely watch that video i just felt guided to share that i think somebody watching this video really needs to start celebrating themselves because that was my case for me like i never really celebrated myself didn't think it was a big deal and just learning like to celebrate everything shifts energy like crazy like it really shifts your energy like it just changes things so um <clears throat> celebrate 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 and let's do some healing now Whew, sacred union, beloved within, inner and outer relationships. Whew, the sunny love and light to your heart, to your soul. Just really honoring the sacredness that is you. Sacredness of who you truly are. So anything, any type of relationship. So whether... You know, it's a romantic relationship with your beloved or your twin flame or friendships or any type of relationship. It always starts with you first, right? Feeling your love, your connection within yourself, the way that you treat yourself, the way that you show up for yourself, the way that you honor yourself, celebrate yourself, right? All makes a difference. And when you're pouring all that love and goodness into yourself, it overflows out to everything and everyone that you're connected to and it changes your relationships, your outer relationships. It makes a really big difference. It's just taking time to honor yourself, treat yourself, treat yourself how you want to be treated by others. <sighs> and allow all that love to just pour into you. So let's cleanse and clear. Release anything blocking or preventing you from allowing you to truly, truly, truly love yourself. Just feel the love, feel the love, the compassion, all that kindness, all that goodness. Allow yourself to really feel it. Any part of you that doesn't feel that you deserve love in any way, shape, or form, allowing it to release with ease and grace and love. It's allowing it to melt away. And again, it's coming back to your true self, your true nature. So your true nature is love, right? Your true nature is love. So anything that's not in alignment to that has to go. So just set that intention. Anything that is not your true nature has to go like goodbye <laughs> just goodbye we're not gonna hold on to anything like anything that's not you anymore so old stories and fears and beliefs and things that are not love it's not you any negative thoughts or beliefs or programming or stories that you've been telling yourself or you took on from other people 
gotta go. This is gonna go because that's not you. It's like sticky, 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 sticky. Feels like sticky. Oh, you can comment below and share how that how it feels for you, but for me, it just feels really heavy, sticky, gunky, like ugh. Because you know that's not you. So if you're feeling some like yucky feelings coming up, it feels bad because that's not you. So let it go. It's okay. Sometimes it doesn't feel so good as it leaves because it's not you and it's been in there, right? If it's been inside of you for so long, but now your body's like, okay, I can feel safe because I know, I know I'm worthy and deserving of love. I am love. So I'm going to let go of what's not in alignment. And sometimes it doesn't feel good when it leaves. Like right now, I'm feeling things leave and it doesn't feel good. It feels kind of yucky. <laughs> it's like, ugh, what is this? This is not even mine. I'm feeling a lot of collective stuff coming out of everyone. <sighs> take nice deep breaths and just let it go. So sometimes we can take on collective energies because... We live, we live in this world and there's energies all around, right? All around us. We go out into the world, you're interacting with people, you're talking to people. You live in a place where there's lots of people. You go online, right? You spend time on social media, looking at the comments. <laughs> you're picking up on all everyone's energy. It's just, that's just a part of living in, in a world with other people. Like we pick up on things, right? So one thing that's so important is to clear energy regularly. I do this every day, multiple times a day. So in the morning and evening, like that is like, that's something I do always because it's so important. And then like throughout the day too, let's say I do spend time on Instagram and I'm looking at things on Instagram. So after that, I just clear my energy, set the intention to release anything that's not mine. Right, call all my energy back to myself, clear out all the other stuff. Right, it can be very simple and powerful. Ask your angels to help you. It's just good energy maintenance so that you don't start to take on everyone's stuff and you're just walking around with everyone's stuff thinking that it's yours and feeling so heavy and bad and it's not yours. So, again, whatever's not yours, let it go. Whatever you're picking up on, let it go. Let's clear any cords and attachments. Anything that's attached to you that's not you. Let it all go. And again, coming back to yourself, to your power. All the love within you. Activating all the love within you. Your magic, your medicine, your gifts. And allowing that to overflow into all of your relationships. <sighs> feeling the love. Feeling the divine divine union within you feeling the divine union within you so masculine feminine balance within you within everything and everyone all around you with you and your beloved your partner or your future partner <sighs> clear energy between you and your partner or future partner with ease grace and love <laughs> i just feel good <laughs> i just felt like like Magical sparkles just came through for everyone. Whew. Opening the doors to love, to union, to connection, to all the goodness within you, within everything and everyone around you, helping to support not only yourself, but everyone on this planet to awaken to their truth because you are so magical and so powerful that when you heal and connect to yourself more deeply and fully, it reawakens, it activates everything and everyone all around you. It's like lights, millions of lights, billions of lights, just sparkling and lighting up. Let's light up the entire planet. Let's light up the souls of every person on this planet. If they're open to it with ease and grace and love. <laughs> wow, this feels good. The heart, allowing your heart to Remember how powerful you are. <sighs> whatever, whatever you need to do or receive to allow this to reawaken how powerful you are. <sighs> You're a powerful, powerful soul. Powerful, powerful human. <laughs> Magical, powerful human. Infinite love, infinite light flowing through you, within you, all around you 
friends, family, loved ones, grounding us all in, working with the beautiful new moon Taurus energy, grounding us all in, <sighs> with ease and grace and love. Whew, that was fun. <laughs> so I check in, see how you're feeling. Oh, just like yesterday's video, I just really feel it in my feet. Like we really did some good work in grounding things in. So we really ground in the intentions. So comment below and share your intentions when it comes to the union within you. So your own pure love and connection to yourself. Comment below your intentions for that. To really anchor it in. And also if you want, you can share share something you're celebrating that's going on in your life share it doesn't even have to be a big thing anything anything you want to celebrate share below so we can anchor that moment in we can just support you in anchoring that moment in again it's just like grounding in every time you celebrate it's like activating that magic and medicine within you it's anchoring that point in your timeline your beautiful timeline of your entire life it's like we can celebrate all the different moments and really like anchor it in and they become like these beautiful points of like portals of light and magic and medicine that you can tap into anytime to help you to remember how powerful you are you think about all of those celebration activation points and it just supports you in remembering right all the things that led you to this moment and how amazing you are it is powerful <sighs> you're powerful <laughs> feels so good so yeah celebrating you celebrating you and all of the beautiful things you're doing uh, if you want to work with me uh, this week's healing download right it's the ancestral energy healing for our money and abundance and we go really deep it's so powerful and super transformative highly recommend it I'm gonna listen to it again this weekend and just like really anchor it in with the new moon energy so <laughs> It's going to be really great and um, you can get it below. Also, if you want to work with me, I have my buy one get one free special this month only. So if you purchase uh, one session, you get two, <laughs> two for one and we can, I can support you in any area of your life so you can share with me you know share with me what's going on in your life and what you want to support with you can tune into your energy and help you so clear things up upgrade right shift things helping you to release old patterns and programming old stories all of that good stuff just helping you to remember how powerful how magical you are right the thing that i really enjoy doing and that one of my gifts is helping people to transform their darkness and the things that they might be ashamed about or they don't like about themselves transform it into the gold transform it into gold and magic and that's your medicine the things that you're not liking things you're afraid of that's your gold and we can transform that help you to see yourself in a whole new light so much love and light and compassion and helping you to embody all parts of you with love and compassion helping you to see all parts of you and see your whole entire life in a whole new perspective because that changes everything because when we're holding on to like resentment or shame for anything in our past whether towards ourselves or others it really weighs us down it's like heavy heavy weights that we're carrying and it's also like kind of like a a blinder and then we can't see can't see how magical you truly are I can't see how wonderful and amazing you truly are and then it impacts your ability to connect with others because you're operating you're operating from these stories that are not true and then other people can't see how they can't see your light as bright right they just can't see you as brightly so when you can shift those things transform those things it improves everything and improves your relationships all your relationships in your life can start to improve or you're going to attract different types of people as well and different experiences right because when our let's say for example so like in our nervous system 
we can store like certain patterns and we're operating on these patterns over and over so like we can end up continuing to attract certain types of people certain types of experiences over and over because that's the energy that's still stored in our system so and that's not your fault right it's like whatever you went through in childhood or even in a uh, past lifetime or other um, ancestral things as well right so as you release those things right in the the energy patterns releasing that out of your system then you can start to operate from new patterns right more empowered patterns and programming that you create for yourself you create your own story instead of operating from other stories other people's stories right releasing projections upon you that's not yours right so that you can be your true self and it's just right then you're free <laughs> you're free to be who you truly are without all this stuff that's not you so energy healing is so powerful and i'm sending you guys so much love bye